So you're probably asking yourselves, why would I need a whammer? Well, for jewellery making, it is an essential tool because you can make all your own findings. Let me show you. So if I was going to make a clasp, say a simple fish hook clasp, I could just do that with my pliers, make the hook, and there we go, we're nearly there. We'll just make the link at the base and curl that up a little bit more. And there you've got your fish hook. But the fish hook at this stage for a clasp is a little bit soft because you can imagine how much wear and tear this will get. You don't want your jewellery to fall apart, especially if you've got beautiful gemstones on it. So to toughen it up, you need to hammer it with the steel face of your whammer. So always use it on a steel block. And you can see I'm hammering it by sort of striking the blow out, pushing the metal out, which means the metal sort of spreads and flattens on that area. You don't need to hammer the whole thing because once you've hardened that area and the opposite end, the rest of it is going to hold. So this clasp now is pretty solid. It's not going to fall apart. So that strengthened it. You can also use it for head pins. So if I wanted to use, make a pair of earrings or hang a bead off, say a bracelet, I could hammer the end to mushroom it out. And you can see how it's spread and flattened and become sort of um, like a spade there. And if you place your bead, this is actually quite a large hole bead, but it, it can't fall off. You can see if you had a, a thinner drill bead, it would sit there. But you can see how that will hold it. And then I could make the link at the top for a nice sort of long um, and elegant earring or dangle. And I can show you here some samples of how I can make chain links. So any shape that I want to make with my pliers and when I hammer them and link them all together, they've all become really firm, solid, won't fall apart, but you can create very beautiful designs with quite thin wire. This is 0.8 wire and um, they can be very delicate and filigree, but each one of them has had a little bit of hammering on the surface to make it hold and make it last. So enjoy using your whammer to make some beautiful pieces of handcrafted jewelry.